What's good, ladies and gentlemen? YouTube J Daisy here with the J Daisy Gaming Channel. Here at a quick look of Grow Up. This is the uh, sequel to the uh, I think it was a clearly yeah the award-winning game Grow Home. Um, this is the sequel Grow Up. It just came out not too long ago, and I wanted to get this video out because it's on sale on Steam right now. They're having a robot theme sale, and this game is on sale. And it's already like 10 bucks, but I think with the sale it was like 6 or 7 I might have my numbers wrong. I don't do my job very well. Um, but, man, if you are looking for a game just to play around in and have fun, I can't remember if I did an actual video on Grow Up right now. I think I did. Um, th this is definitely worth the 6 Even if you get it at full price at 10 bucks, it is definitely worth it. It's from Ubisoft, um, from an indie developer that they have kind of on retainer. Um... And I have been playing for probably, oh, three or four hours now, and I've just gotten to the first stage. It's a climbing game, and the whole point is, if you didn't see the first game, uh, it's a very childlike game, but very fun at the same time. You are this little character named Bud. Say hello, Bud. Hello. Um, and you were on a ship, and the ship's called Mom. Um, these are all acronyms for things I don't remember. Um, but Mom crashed on the moon, and your goal is to get to back to Mom and rebuild her. Um, and you do this by building these giant plants. This thing right next to me is a giant. It's called a uh, star plant. Um, and it, your whole point of the game is to help it grow. But this, unlike Grow Home, is an entire planet. Uh, hold on, I had to stop myself from dying here. Um... Yes, it's an entire planet, and you have a few little companions that help you along the way. Like, if you hit tab, you get to see it's called Pod, and he is a little satellite floating around that helps you show all the different things. So, like, here you can see that there's a pod part, but that is all... Oh, God, I'm falling. Um, that's all the way over there. Over... Where'd it go? I lost it. Um, there? Maybe? And uh, as you climb, you find these crystals that give you more power, and you find these little, um, what do you even call them, uh, nodes that, sorry, it's hard to concentrate and talk at the same time. You find these little nodes that um, help you get more power-ups, like the jetpack I have using. And something different about this game is you get to unlock these seeds, and the seeds you can throw anywhere, and... Once you find that plant, you scan it, and you get ability to use its seeds, and you can just throw them anywhere, and now you have that plant at your disposal. I primarily use it for the bouncy ones, um, because the jetpack's just a little hard to use. Like I said, I'm not very far. I'm not even close to being done. Um, but if you're looking for a game that you can pick up for under, like, 20 bucks and get absolute time and time out of it, even if you finish the game... You can just mess around growing your star plant. I mean, this, that all right there, that little weird Culey Q thing is all the stuff I grew. Because you have to connect the plant to these little nodes to help it grow. Um, you saw me do that a little earlier. I grabbed onto that, ah, um, node thing and it grew into the mountain. Um, that's how you just grow it along. And you grow it up to collect more nodes to get it bigger. And you're, the ultimate goal is to rebuild mom because she crashed. Um, but, man... I, with the size of this planet, it is just an ongoing thing, and you can't swim, so I gotta jump over this. Um, you can die, like, if you crash the game and stuff, but they're very generous with the respawn points. You actually have to open... Oh, here, we can scan this plant right here. Look at that. Um, you just hold it, and there you go. Now you got a new plant, um, that you can use at any time. Oh, another one, perfect. Um, I've never been to this side of the planet because it's just so huge. I mean, it's just a massive thing because you're just this little bot. And it's a very much climbing game, like that's what it would be called as. But the climbing mechanics for the mouse and keyboard, anyway, are left and right on the mouse. So it's, I mean, it just gets so easy to use just alternating those fingers. So it's very intuitive there. It's exactly what you would expect from Ubisoft or like an indie developer that's backed by Ubisoft to have this kind of quality. And it's a very simple game, but God, it is just f I can't recommend this enough if you are looking for a price-cost analysis kind of thing. It is definitely worth it. And this little thing we're going to that's beeping very loud is a little save node. You just gotta drop down the little... Oop, oop, oop. 
walking's a little difficult. So is controlling the plants, because it's all kind of dynamic, I guess would be the best word to put it. Um, so it kind of just responds the way physically it would respond. And we hear the awesome sound of dial-up internet, and that means we have a new little respawn spot. So if we die, we can respawn here. And if we look... See? Uh, zooming in. There's our little respawn point. I, I just can't recommend this enough, especially with it being on Steam sale right now. I would definitely say pick it up. Um, I think the sale lasts until this weekend. Um, this video is not that long. I apologize. I am getting ready to play Mafia 3 tonight. That video will be coming hopefully out tonight. The game releases at 11 o'clock here. Um, so I will be up and I will get playing it as soon as it's released. And I'll probably play an hour and then upload the video, create all the clip art and stuff. So it should be up um, by like the morning time at the very latest, latest. And then I have Friday or tomorrow off Friday, and I will play as much as I can, get that uploaded. But then the downfall is for the next four weeks, I work every single day at work. So for the next four weeks, we might not have as many videos as possible. Um, I might get a few pre-recorded and then release them throughout. But I can't make any such promises. Um, Oh, here it's, I didn't know what I was climbing towards. This is a little uh, challenge. Um, if we, oh no, this is the upgrade thing. Never mind, I'm wrong. If we open up all these panels, this is how you get your little upgrades. Here we go. And bloop. You can now curl up in a ball and roll around. Oh, would you look at that? I, this is not planned. <laughs> <laughs> that makes me very happy. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, maybe I'll get some review videos up and running. So they might not be the newest videos for the next couple weeks. Um, but it, I am going to try and, that little crystal up there. That is what you're looking for as far as the upgrade things. There are a lot of them, um, and they just kind of give your jetpack more fuel and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that's kind of the game plan for the next couple weeks as far as the channel goes. What's going to happen tonight? And grow home. I or grow up. I apologize. I highly recommend this game for a price cost analysis and just as a fun little game to mess around with. I, I mean, I jump in for a little half hour, climb around, build my star plant a little higher, and stuff. It's it, it, there's no like there's no serious undertone that you have to concentrate on. I mean, I watch YouTube videos and and play this. It's a great little game. Highly recommend it. Um. But yeah, guys, that's all I got for t for right now. I can't say today because I'll be back on tonight. Um, so as always, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to leave them down in the comment box below or hit me up on any of the social medias. I love to hear the feedback. Or if you have any suggestion of games you'd like to see a review on or anything of that nature, uh, feel free to let me know. And as always, have a great one.